In this video we will explain what is P and ID and how to read the P and ID. What is P and ID? Piping and instrumentation diagram plays a major role in the process industry. This diagram would be composed of the components which are used to check and control a specified process. This diagram can be considered as a blueprint of a system in a section of the industrial plant. A P and ID could be a detailed flow diagram of the processing unit, ancillary unit, an off-site product storage system, product loading system, or it could be a drawing of the process and instrumentation system that connects different operating facilities together. The process plant can be designed and maintained with help of a piping and instrumentation diagram. This drawing would show the details of the piping and instrumentation of the processing unit. What is the purpose of P and ID? Process system operation would take place very safely with the help of a P and ID. This diagram would display the equipment interconnections in a process and it would also display the instrumentation that controls the process. We can use this diagram for the development of the process. This diagram would be useful while doing the maintenance and also for the modification of the process. The process operation can be carried out safely with the help of this diagram. We should keep the P and ID up to date if we have done any modification to the process then it must be included in this diagram. What are the major functions of the P and ID? The major function of the P and ID is to show the equipment and their interconnection in a process, so that it can be utilized to do the maintenance and also the modification of the process. This diagram would be very useful for the design stage, in which it would provide the basis for the development of the control system. It can also be utilized to do the hazard and operational study, HAZOP study. All equipment with their name and also their specified tag numbers. Instrumentation and their designation along with indicators, recorders, and controllers all valves and their specified tag numbers open loop and closed loop control representation. Size of the piping and also the material which is used for its construction vents, drains, special fittings, and sampling lines flow direction permanent startup and flush lines control inputs and outputs computer control system input. What are the information which is not included in the P and ID? Manual switches control relays instrument root valves equipment rating and capacity pressure, temperature, and flow data pipe fittings such as elbows, T's physical details and dimensions piping connection and type like flanged, threaded, etc. It should show all the required instruments and control loops interlock numbers should be marked as per the interlock description it must have all the equipment with the necessary piping which is required for the process it must have all the connecting process piping which is required to carry out the process. It should show all the piping which is needed for the auxiliaries it must show all the required valves and also the major non-standard fittings mark size, fluid code, material code and identification numbers of all the pipelines should be included. 